What's going on, guys? <gasps> it's your boy Ooch, and we are back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? All right, guys, it's this uh, time of the month, <laughs> and uh, you know, it's you know, it's just to put up some punctuation on it. I don't know why I'm making these puns. <laughs> Dragon Ball Super is back again, once again, with another chapter, chapter 79, one more away from 80. 80 will start off the new year in 2022 because it is December at this time. And uh, this is Gas versus Granola. Now, I have been paying attention, obviously, to comments. And I did see someone mention that they wished or missed that uh, I... Or, yeah, they would prefer that I would do the old style of how I did these manga reactions. Which is basically me kind of just reading the entire thing for the video. Like, obviously, like, you know, you guys see the, the whole... The, the full reaction, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. So, I will... Go back to doing that. Um, I did have a lot of fun editing it in the style that I did the last time, but honestly and obviously that took a little bit more time to just kind of put all together. And uh, here I am now going back to an older way because I guess you guys enjoyed that as well. But at least the good part about it is that I should be able to get these out a lot faster. So that's a good thing. And also if there's other if other like manga like Boruto I haven't done in a while, I actually have to catch up with that one. I'm like five chapters behind. And uh, with My Hero Academia, I'm also behind on that. But if there's any other others that you'd probably want like some kind of live format reactions, then do let me know and I will consider it. So without further ado, let's get <laughs> So just like in the fashion of the old ones, I will have the little, you know, displayed but minuscule version because you know obvious copyright but if something big happens i got i got some uh i got something for you guys you can see the whole the whole image in its entirety all right so here we go so so elik drinking a nice little bit of wine there i'm guessing gas is now the mightiest in the universe elixir shall we move the ship closer to the battlefield only once the fight's over have you ever seen an active battlefield I don't want debris falling into my wine. Fair enough. Well, very well, uh, very well, sir, says this uh, little servant. Besides, I've got one more urgent errand to handle. Okay, yeah, see, so I figured Elik was up to something. It's obvious that he was definitely up to something else. And there's way more to the wish of gas being the strongest, but here we go. So the fight ensues. Spill the beans, geezer. Where'd Vegeta go? Heck if I know. Playing dumb, are we? Maybe oil can convince you to wisen up. Oh, he goes, heh heh heh. He's big and bad. Okay, so that Vegeta's uh, giving Granola the sense of being, right? This is kind of where we left off in the last chapter. So he eats it. Nom nom. Instantly rejuvenated. Welcome to Dragon Ball Granola, where you are now officially a part of the... Uh, the roster of characters that have been graced with such an edible. Wow. Anyway, uh, what is this? One moment I was down for the count, but now this is incredible. We just go on. Don't waste the sense of being. Ooh, that look on his face. An instant boom. Man, my man looked like he had instant transmission for a second. Look at this. Granola, how are you still standing? The old man's off limits. And then boom, blast them back. And it looked like Gas was about to freaking kill Goku on the side there. And he looks right at Gas. Your energy has been restored. Were you healed somehow? And then uh, Manito says, don't forget your partner, Granola. Oh, he had the he had the eye thing. I forgot all about that thing. Um, I forget what it was called. But we're, I'm sure we'll know in a second. I swear, if you ever chuck me aside again. Sorry about that oatmeal. There it is. Does the universe's strongest have no need of my support? No, I'll always want you backing me up. All right, so now, oh, so he he put it on and he powers up and it looks like he's like super granola now, right? Because you can see they, they have a close up on his eye pattern. Um, Leave it that small. I get, I'm hoping we're, we won't get in trouble for it, but if we do, then Obviously, we're going to have to adjust from there. So just so you guys are fully, fully aware. Okay. So here we go. So now. Okay. So he's powered up. Right. Vegeta smiles. He goes, get down here, Gas. You're here to fight me. So Gas throws Goku to the side like he's nothing. And then he goes, 
just so and then he oh and he, he whips out some shields okay so you know you, we already know our boy gas is all about his weapon creation right he's creative of dragon ball that rotten granola how is he looking peppier than ever he was beaten to a pulp just a bit ago relax we know gas is the strongest now he's gonna win this for us all right so now the face off gas between granola and they're fighting gas goes for an attack granola dodges oh he's trying to hit him with that quick sniper shot and i feel like that's why gas has the shields up just in case he's not trying to get shot point blank so he right now he's defending all these shots he still goes in granola dodges gas eats all the dirt in the earth this action is very very nice looking i can show you this really quick as well and oh and then granola gets a shot in okay but then gas whips out some freaking uh kunai knives and then what okay granola puts out like some type of energy kind of defense mechanism but granola uh, but gas is still trying to throw more at him granola says your heart rate oh no that's that must that must be uh, oatmeal your heart rate is elevated remain calm and focus so this guy he's like his, it's like his little computer system that's interesting he's like got it he's like basically jarvis for granola that's basically what that is oh hold on he says ah oh, wait there's a wrecking ball incoming from above oh and then granola was forced to catch it oh did it explode does it explode tell me it explodes yo that's od it actually exploded on him that's crazy okay not so fast granola you're surrounded by projectiles there are 46 of them within a 50 chi chia seed radius wow they have measurements in chia seeds that's okay interesting and then I'm telling you, Gas would have such a godlike moveset in a fighting game. They need to put him in fighters. They should. Android 21, freaking in her regular non-Android looking, like in her professor suit, is getting her own character. Like, not just an outfit. She's going to be playable separate from Majin 21 in Dragon Ball Fighters. They need to put they need to put characters from the freaking manga into Dragon Ball Fighters. Gas would be OD. He's toast. Good going oh gr what granola caught them all he threw he throws them to the ground he goes these tricks won't work on me anymore and goku goes well how's granola holding up vegeta goes as well as his opponent or better goku goes oh yeah nice not surprised yeah because these are they're basically it looks like they're they're pretty much even because they both are the strongest in the universe right now you know they both wished for it but i mean gas should be the strongest one since his wish was more recent but you know i digress let's continue so the fighting ensues they're going back and forth still trading a bunch of blows gas makes a spear and another shield but it looks like granola mad quick goes right in and mm, decks him. i like that look at this i'll show this i'll show this one to you guys okay there we go hit gets hit in a tree watch out for that tree uh gas is a george of the jungle for a second and then he goes, give me a break how's gas getting beaten back now vegeta says gas only achieved the title of strongest a bit ago google goes oh yeah so he can't make use of his full power yet just like granola at first vegeta goes i suspect so okay so there's the there's the explanation right then and there so because he's not used to the power that explains why granola currently has the one up on him right now i feel like that's such a cop-out excuse we've seen that reason happen so many times but whatever let's let's keep reading so granola is charging in at him and gas is waiting for him with a spear and it looks like granola is still yeah he's still getting some offensive on him he literally kicks him up in the air gas is actually like trying to wipe off some blood on his face vegeta says the gap between them is evident this is granola's chance goku says but why is gas sticking to just that one move using those strange weapons vegeta goes hard to say perhaps he gained that ability from the wish to become the strongest oh yeah manito says nope 
Gas has always used those weapons. He creates out of nothing. Okay, good. So that right there all but confirms it because Manito again, of course, was the witness of the fight between him and Bardock all those years ago. Yo, my man Gas is making some demon wind shuriken. Anyway, let's continue. This guy is 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 crazy. Oh, yo, Granola caught it. That's that's OD. He he. You know what? Let me show you that. Let me show y'all that too, real quick, because that is actually Granola is out of his mind right now. He needs to finish it mad quick. So he hits him back. Gas is looking a little a lot weaker now. He goes, why? Why rely solely on that arsenal of yours? I get it. Gas wants to beat Granola with his own str <sighs> Well, that... Okay. He's holding back. He's holding back. Okay. Didn't that wish give you new powers to use? Yeah, Gas is struggling. And then, and then she goes... I can't remember their names, but... It ain't that Gas can't wield his newfound power the right way. He just doesn't wanna. <laughs> what the hell? Yo, this dude is crazy. Okay. If this is all you've got, then you're done for. Uh-oh. The stern look on his face. Nah. Yo, look at this. Look at this. Right to the face. Amazing. Vegeta and Goku are going berserk. He countered. Wow. He blew a bunch of Earth back with him too. Granola is down. Gas seems a little irked that he had to do that. And then Granola goes, I knew it. You were holding back your new strength. I consider this a failure on my part. I had hoped to kill you with the technique I've honed. And then and then uh, Granola trying to waste no more time. Start shooting finger beams at him. Ooh, yo, gas is OD. Gas is the truth. That's what I'm saying. It, it would, it, it makes more sense that he would clearly be way more strong than Granola because he made the wish more recent. So he pretty much like instant transmission his way over. It's not really instant, but you know what I mean. So. Oh, wait, no, Goku confirms. He goes, instant teleportation. Oh, any abilities you have gained are now mine as well. Oh, Granola shot to the stomach. Okay, he freaking, he's feeling it. Because my power is far superior to yours. As it should be. Blast him back. And just like that, Granola is out for the count. See you later. You're done. I'm pretty sure Granola's done. Granola is done. They literally just watched him freaking get blasted off like Team Rocket. And Vegeta goes, that looked like destruction. He never needed those extra weapons. So wait a minute. Do you mean to tell me that if you just wish to, for yourself to be the strongest in the universe, do you just have a do you have the ability to just have all types of abilities? Because Goku pointed out that he did his transmission, like verbatim. Like I thought it just looked like his transmission, but you really know how that goes in anime. Like characters, when it comes to speed and movement, they usually end up looking like they're doing it in transmission. And that's like a trope that I feel like a lot of fans or viewers, whatever, that know of his transmission, they'll, they'll, they'll call it that just because, you know, I guess out of homage to Goku, whatever. But now Vegeta's out here saying that that looked like a destruction. So he's basically saying that gas hit him with destruction and then gas just says right now i see now okay but granola's not done just yet okay he, he he's still here ladies and gentlemen he's still here okay i never thought taking you down would actually be that easy so he takes his coat off so now we got we got a new look granola low key he's got suspenders okay he says well go on what can the universe's strongest muster i've still got plenty on or still, i still got plenty of fight left in me oh so he tries to enter transmission himself okay gas blocks it but then he kicks him back 
Granola quick on the come up. He's still coming at him. The action is going crazy. But now they're saying now it's like almost like they're they're back to even grounds now. So now Granola kicks him in the face. But then Gaz gets behind him and then blasts him. And it's like they're literally going back and forth right now. And then Goku says, Are they for real? They're both using instant teleportation like it's nothing. And I struggle so hard to learn that move. Yeah, I feel like if you are if you make that wish, you for whatever reason just obtain all types of abilities. Which is abilities and techniques, which is kind of which is kind of ridiculous, but I guess it makes sense. It's not. It's just something that you just wouldn't really expect. But yeah, they're they're literally just going back and forth right now. Vegeta says, "Like it's no big deal." No, take a closer look. Goku says, "Huh?" Gas still isn't familiar with that move. He boasts speed and power. Yes. But have you ever seen instant teleportation used so sloppily? Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah, because he's doing it, or he's trying to, but Ga but Granola is actually getting the hits on him. More so. But they're still tra they're still even though. Like they're still they're still going back and forth. Goku goes, you're right. And Vegeta says, if nothing else, Granola wields it more accurately. He still stands a chance. All right, and that's where the chapter ends. All right. Well, hmm. to say the least, this was definitely a very interesting chapter. Um, it was very, it was very granola gas uh, centric, which is not a bad thing. Um, these are, of course, the two strongest in the universe characters to live up to the name of this arc right now. Um, and it only makes sense that they're both fighting back and forth because they are, you know, both the strongest in the universe right now, even though gas uh should be like pretty much destroying granola right now granola gas is kind of having a self-conflicting moment where he does not want to rely on this newfound power that he just he just received um which might be his downfall but that also kind of makes me even more curious now as to how this fight with bardock went because that means that maybe the fact that he has this powered up vert form that is not off of the wish that is just something that gas can do presumably i mean we have to see more and what's also crazy is that they of course have this ability to just ba you know just do moves that they never really was doing before so yeah I, I i think overall the chapter was pretty dope but i'm kind of i'm i'm, I'm only I, I say this very loosely I'm, I'm i'm only let down because i was really hoping to get that backstory part for bardock and gas because i i oh man i just want to see it. i just i want to see what happens and I want to see if my theory is correct with Bardock, of course, showing us something that we haven't seen yet in the, in this, in this story. And if he is the one that, you know, essentially unlocks this path of power that is, you know, natural to the Saiyans, which is, you know, of course, something that looks a, a lot like Super Saiyan 4. With all that being said, I will bid you all adieu because I want you guys to definitely stay tuned for the in-depth breakdown of this chapter and all of our thoughts myself brother uch and my are the homie kai right we are we we are are all going to be going over this chapter in the upcoming episode of the full power podcast which you will definitely be able to watch right here on youtube later this week or if you're a patreon backer you will be able to hear it early so if that's something that interests you definitely check out the patreon which is also going to be in the link below and if you guys want to interact with me a lot more uh, then definitely follow me on Twitter and check out me out on Twitch. Again, all these links are going to be in the description as always. But guys, make sure you guys take care of yourselves. Make sure you keep the black wood right here on this channel. Stay safe, stay clean, stay inside. I will see y'all next time.